Hello, it's Mr. Tanner from Family Martial Arts, and we've got a special message going out towards Tyler Price. I hear you've uh, been neglecting in your training a little bit recently, which, you know, is a little bit understandable, but I'm here with a little bit of motivation for you to get, to get training again. So when you're at home or with, with mum or nan or, or anyone that's willing to train with you, I've got a little drill I want you to try out, okay? But first, you're going to need your blocker <laughs> okay so to start off with they're going to be holding the blocker and i want you to have your guard up like this all right at any point they're going to try and get you okay they're going to try and get you on the head if they try and get you on the head i want you to do your high block like this okay and then bring it straight back to guard okay? and when he's doing that really well then i want you to have that high guard, have his guard but then have a chamber and then a high block before he does it for me then I want you to start swinging it into the sides and I want you to then, Tyler, I want you to then block it to the side using your middle and a forearm block um, and then back to your guard, your middle and a forearm block and back to guard. And when he's got that all right, then start getting him to do it with the chambers. Okay. Then we're gonna go for the low blocks now. You can go straight from the guard and down or what's best is to have a chamber and then drop it down, chamber and drop it down to stop those, the, the blocker from getting from those sides. Once you've got all of them, Tyler, then they're going to do it randomly. So instead of just going for your head, then it'll be going for your sides, then going for the low sides as well. And it could be anywhere. And you've got to try and get your chambers whilst you're the blocking all of these attacks coming towards. That last one is the wrong chamber, but I'm talking at the same time. Anyway, then it gets a little bit harder, Tyler, because we've got to make the training, uh, we've got to push you a little bit. We'll push everybody when they're training. So we're gonna have your guard, and this time the block is gonna come straight at you, boom, like 3D stuff. So it's coming straight at you, and you're gonna to have to parry, okay, as it comes in. Still keeping your guard, so you've got the parries this way, whilst also trying to block the high blocks, the middle blocks, the low blocks, okay, and still parrying at the same time. Then, Tyler, we're gonna move it on to the next bit. Okay, I'm gonna to have to move the camera for this one. There we go. And we're then going to try and do it with some balance training. So even if you haven't got one of these, that's okay. You can, uh, you can have a pillow or just restrict the space. Okay? But start off with, you're going to have your feet together and you're going to try and block everything without stepping your leg out. Okay? So you've got to control where your feet are all the time. And okay? then... We're going to lift up one leg and we're going to try and do it at the same time. Now, I know it's really, really tricky, but that's the essence of the game. It's got to be difficult uh, to help your training. Anyway, um, Tyler, I hope you enjoy those exercises. Um, I will find out if you've been doing them or not. So, um, uh, yeah, we'll keep an eye out. Uh, and everybody else, um, that is a great exercise for ninjas to do in their training as well. So... Uh, look forward to hearing from you. And if any other um, any other ninjas or juniors need a little bit of uh, a little bit of motivation, uh, drop us a message, and uh, we might do a personalised training routine just for them. We'll post up. Okay. See ya.